Well, 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 what do you know? We got some loungefly.com delivery update information I want to go ahead and share with you all. Now, in this particular video here, I'm going to be showing you a few of the comments that I was able to pull off a loungefly Instagram page with this particular post. And you all can go see the post as well. Up under that post, it, it has over 300 comments. Now, I didn't read through every single comment, but I read through enough. And the ones that I did read and I thought were more interesting, those are the ones I'm going to be talking about and showing you all today. Also, collectors, make sure you stay towards the end of the video because Sweet Wills will give her opinion about this whole situation. Don't have a lot to say, but I think it'll just be enough. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into it. Now, if you all want to read everything, you can go ahead and knock yourself out. I'm just going to skim through it, okay, because I need to get this video done. But this post here, you can find on Loungefly Instagram, and it says, Delivery Update. Thank you for shopping with us this season. Sorry about the delays, but if you did order before... December the 6th, your order should arrive before Christmas. In the meantime, go ahead and use this discount code, okay? We apologize and sorry for the inconvenience. My question is for the collectors out there, how many of y'all decided to place an order anyway? Because I know some collectors may have placed the order. I know a lot of folks talking about they didn't, but I just want to be nosy, all right? Now that I've gotten that out of the way, let's move on to what they post up under this particular post. As you can see, it's the same thing that you all just read yourself. They're apologizing for the shipping delays. Go ahead and use this discount code, thank you 22 at checkout for 15% off. Now, some exclusions apply. In my opinion, I think at this point, nothing should have been excluded from this 15% off. That, but that just sweet wills, you know. Just sweet wills opinion. I think everything should have been 15% off. Now, let's get into some of these comments, all right? Some of these comments that I'm going to have in this video are going to be back and forth, meaning somebody commented, another person commented behind them, and another person commented behind them. And some of them are just single comments, so please bear with your girl as I go through this, all right? So the first comment you all see, a collector posted, mine from Cyber Monday still hasn't shipped. I won't be ordering anything else, even with a silly promo code. Someone else, another collector stated, same here. Someone else mentioned, good, more for the dedicated customers who are actually understanding. Listen, listen. I can relate to both of these individuals are saying. I haven't received my order from Cyber Monday. You're going to give me a code to spend more money. And that's the thing about this ordering now. The orders that you placed before that particular date that I mentioned earlier in the video that you're going to receive before the 25th. What about the orders you're placing now? When are you going to receive those? That's the question I want to know. And even if I don't place an order, I mean, I'm sure other collectors want to know as well. And for the responder that said good more for us, listen, that there could apply to me and maybe, maybe not with Loungefly, but probably with Funko, okay? Because I have some stuff I didn't miss out on like that. I don't want to even get into it. So I can understand that maybe not in this situation right here, but in other situations. But let's move on. This is another one of them back and forth comments. So the first part, and I'm going to start with the left, it says, I probably own more bags than some small shop businesses have inventory. So let's not talk about dedicated customers before knowing. Now, this here, I think is piggybacking on what I just talked about. I think so but we're gonna roll with it all right because I, I like how it's going so the next person said the fact of the matter is if you're saying you're not buying anymore you're not dedicated anymore it doesn't matter how many you own Ooh, okay all right oh all right and it gets a little bit um a little little, little intense when you go to the right side at the top because the other comment says if you're not buying from them anymore you're not currently dedicated as the fellow comment above me says lol Ooh, okay Hold up now. Let's go down below before I say anything. It says, up under that, it says, oh my goodness, who cares? The promo code is kind of dumb. Like it shouldn't have, it, like it should have been applied to the orders that got delayed or haven't even shipped. Listen, that's what I was saying. And maybe because you know your girl, Sweet Wheels, I like to roll on the cheap cheap. Ooh, there's a Sweet Wheel, cheap cheap. Always looking out for this cheap cheap. Ooh, there's a sell on cheap cheap. You better get it for it, be gone cheap cheap. All right. Also, let me go ahead and throw this in here. Someone asked me, where did I get that song from? I actually created it from the top of my head. Listen, all this stuff in these videos, this from the top of the dome. I don't have a sheet. I don't have a paper. I don't have rehearsals or none of that. It's just I flow with it, which makes it so much better, you all. It makes it better, I'm telling you. Now, let's get back to these comments, shall I? Also, it's silly to be proud of owning so many Loungefly backpacks. Reeks of 
consumerism, but to each their own. Now see, stuff like this, I'm telling you, this, what I just read, it actually went on, I think, a little bit longer. I just didn't cover everything. I just want to post this. I believe, I think, if I can remember, these back and forth comments went on a little bit longer. I just didn't go... I just didn't want to post everything. Just want to show you all. And I know a lot of you all know how it get down up under the comment section when it comes to lounge fly. It can get real, real up in here. I apologize to anyone that would like to see the end result of this conversation. Like I mentioned, like I mentioned, I only took bits and pieces of comments from under that post. If you all want to see how it really went down on this particular comment, you can definitely go to Instagram on lounge fly and just scroll through the po post. It shouldn't be too hard. It went too far down at all. Single comment post here. Discount should be applied to orders that were already purchased and late, not new orders. I totally agree. And that's because if I can get anything off of any orders, I'm all with it. Listen, ain't nothing like a coupon on top of a coupon that had a coupon that needed a coupon. Y'all don't hear me. I'm telling you. I ain't playing with it. I be trying to stack. How many of y'all like that? Like, they already give you 70%, additional 25%, but then you be trying to use your birthday code on top of that. Oh, <laughs> Ooh, that be me. I be going looking for codes. Let me see. Codes on loungefly.com. Free shipping on Shop Disney. What's up with them free shipping codes? Anybody got a free shipping code? Because your girl can use one. How many of y'all still got it to where you not going to order until you get your stuff free shipped? How many of y'all like that on Shop Disney? Okay. Shop Disney, y'all here. Shop Disney, you watching. You might want to drop that free shipping down to orders 50 and above get free shipping. I'm just saying. I'm throwing it out. This next single post. Do any of you realize how much time and how hard it would be to go through every person's individual order to give them additional 15% off? I don't, I don't think it'll be hard. What do you think? I don't think so. I mean, they can do it. I mean, if they really wanted to. They just get a team of people just to hire for that day. Or just select certain people like Sweet Wills, 19 at gmail.com, and give her 15% off. I think she deserves it. She really does. But let's continue. Just be grateful they're giving us anything at all. Some of y'all ask for too much. Uh, excuse me. Uh, oh, no. How did that? I mean, can we get somebody to erase this comment? This here just ain't gonna work for me. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Even though I'm the one that read it first, screenshot, and I'm putting this video. Um, but anywho's, as for delays, that's to be expected around this time. That's true. If you're worried about Christmas present arriving on time, start start ordering them early. That part there, I'm going to have to go ahead and erase. And maybe I shouldn't even mention this because a lot of people did order before Christmas time and still haven't received their stuff yet. No shipping confirmation or nothing. But I do understand what they're saying for us ordering before Christmas because, yes, if you want to make sure you get your stuff before Christmas, order before Christmas. But when it comes to this situation here, a lot of people haven't received anything. Love the comment. I wish I had the power to erase this because I don't need them getting any, I don't need them to have any pushback ideas like this, okay? Shout out to this collector, but hold on, we, we, we need to talk. Now, this single comment was interesting, okay? It states, if resellers didn't buy up multiple of these sales, they wouldn't have, have, they wouldn't have had been such a demand. Sucks for those who sold before getting in hand and now have people waiting on both ends. Let me say this to you all out there. Going into 2023, if you are still bothered by resellers, and I'm not saying that this collector is, okay? I don't mind people venting and maybe complaining every now and then. But the blame game should be over with. Resellers are in every single thing. You either going to join them, which some collectors have. Some collectors are using these programs, believe it or not. They just not telling you all. But it's either you're going to join them or you're going to try to beat them. And if you lose, hey, let's work on figuring out how you can go about beating them next time. Because I'm telling you, they ain't going nowhere. And they, they in your groups. They see your comments. They don't never post. How I know? Because I know one. That's how I know. They never post. They don't say nothing. They sitting back eating their popcorn, making that extra money off them bags, laughing at you. I'm telling you, they're laughing. Laughing so hard to the bank, though. Imagine laughing, going to the bank and cashing in. I don't know what that's like. I'm hoping to experience that one day myself. But that's what's happening. So 
thanks for the collector for that comment, but I really would like for folks to get a better grip on how this whole collecting thing works. A lot of people have. Some people are like, you know what, I ain't about to be, you know what, they're here to stay. Let me go about beating them. Some folks like, uh-uh, no, that shouldn't be happening. Lounge fly, Funko, tennis shoe, all that. They need to stop these people. If they can stop these people, why haven't they stopped these folks? That's the question we need to be asking. Can you stop these people? That's what we need to ask them. Can you stop them from using these programs? And if not, why you can't? Let's get some answers. If we can't get a resolution, whoop, whoop. Thank you all so much for sticking around in this video. I know it's a lot of comments, but I'm kind of almost sort of what done you all. But look, let's continue. Next collector mentioned a very bold statement committing to fulfilling orders by Christmas when orders that were placed over a month ago haven't been haven't even been fulfilled. Yeah, I'm telling y'all, it's a lot of orders folks mentioned that they placed and have yet to ship nothing. Can't help but feel days before Christmas will be slapped with another apology. We'll see how this goes. Um, lounge fly, lounge fly, lounge fly, oh lounge fly. Please do not. I'm hoping you all that this does not happen. Another apology for orders. And the question is, like I mentioned earlier, what about the orders that folks are placing now with this 15% off? When is that going to ship? That, I mean, <laughs> I think that's a reasonable um, question. But I can understand where this collector's coming from. I really, I truly do. Moving right along. I ordered the skirt on November the 11th. I received the sweater November 26th with no skirt. I ordered both pieces before Black Friday sale. Got an email December the 2nd saying, sorry, your skirt is sold out. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I got a question. How many of y'all ever experienced something like this? Where you placed the order for an item or items and it, was, it wasn't in your in your box when you received it you contacted launch fly to let them know now in most cases the items may not be online or the items may be online how many y'all ever experienced that and received the items you were supposed to receive or you still got the sorry we don't have any more available put that down below in the comment section it wasn't sold out when i placed the order hmm got a got a point there I am sorry, that is unacceptable and poor customer service. You don't even have a number to call, just an email. I mean, a lot of companies don't have phone numbers, which can be okay. But for some reason, a lot of collectors, even up under this post, and I've seen this multiple times around on different posts with in these lounge fly groups, that some collectors have a hard time getting in touch with lounge fly with this email. Some folks still waiting to receive an email from from orders that they may have placed, whether they had issues with them or maybe something else they want to reach out to Longfly. Or this email seems to be causing some problems with some collectors. I wish I had the answer for you all. A lot of things could help this situation. Listen, I don't know what's going on in the Stitch Shop Longfly factory with these emails. Maybe they need more people on the team. Maybe they do have more people on the team. They just overloaded with emails. I don't know. It can be anything. But let's move on. I'm going to guess this collector was Russian when they made this comment. I'm going to tell you something. Spell check is not my best friend. I'm not going to tell y'all what it says whenever I type in Snow White name. It just messed up. I'm going to go ahead and read what I think they're saying. I just made my order two months ago and it still hasn't shipped. I made sure the order before the crazy and they keep blaming the holidays. There were no holidays when I ordered, frustrated, and I'm a side eye roll that 15% discount. Okay, okay, okay. Because two months ago, though, oh my goodness, that's a long time. I mean, two months ago, was that in October? Don't tell me that was in October. Please don't tell me they placed the order in October, they still haven't received nothing. Now, that's wild, real wild. Oh my goodness. I'm hoping, you know what? I'm hoping up under that post, somebody was able to get in touch with her to help her out because that there is not cool. Oh no, that's not cool at all. With that big of a delay, I probably side eye rolled at 15% too. <laughs> Next comment, please. Such a joke. I emailed multiple times and I'm still waiting. Loungefly created a UPS label and it's been sitting for almost a month. Listen, that happens a lot. Okay, yeah, listen, a month? <laughs> Whew. 
Let me tell you something. Stuff like that happens a lot, especially to me. Oh, don't talk about when I order outside the country and that joke could be sitting in Chicago for three to four months. Y'all don't hear me. That happens. Now, with this here, this can be a lot of different things. And I don't have a particular answer. But I'm hoping that I'm, this person here, somebody reach out to them. Next collector. Beware ordering directly from Loungefly. I ordered a dress and a couple of backpacks, but the dress was never sent. Took full payment for an order that took a month to get sent out. And then claimed the dress was sold out. Took almost a week for their customer service to get back to me and offer and only offer 10% off as an apology. You see how they, as an uh, apology, hmm, that means they think their 10% offer is a joke, okay? Um, man, what's, what's really going on over there? Now, I know what these companies' mistakes do happen. You're supposed to know, you, you seem like you're taking up from them. No, trust me, mistakes do happen. Now, the question is, how long did it take you to get your money back, okay? But that 10%, maybe... <sighs> I, that's what I want to know. How long it took you to get your money back? I'm hoping for now, going forward, that they maybe double, triple check the package. But I don't work in the packaging department, so I don't know how it's going. For those of y'all who work in that department, put that down below in the comment section to kind of help out folks like me, you know, and others. Next one, it says, terrible shipping times and customer service. A mass post is very unprofessional. A lot of people were saying that, Okay. If people are paying money for your service, you should you should at least answer their emails and try to ship their orders in a timely manner. I'm telling y'all, a lot of collectors, not just on this particular post, but I've seen uh, I've seen as time goes along, complain about reaching out to Loungefly and not getting and not having their emails read, or at least have the wait time listed at the time of purchase it's extremely misleading for customers and you continuously are releasing new items but can't even ship the products that have already been purchased definitely don't recommend purchasing directly from this website a month wait for products to just ship is just ridiculous i mean if you don't purchase from them where you plan on going that's what I want to know because what other folks are saying, even with some of the small shops, the shipping is delayed. Unless it's in stock and ready to ship, you might have a chance. Then again, you got to check their shipping policy. How many days does it take for them to ship? That is a good question. I think all all companies need to go to their shipping arm section and make sure whatever they put down that they're going to deliver. Because I'm telling you, them lounge fly collectors be on it. They be on it. They don't have no problem posting you in a hot second. I'm telling you. I don't think they even give it a second. Is there anything less than in a second? Is there anything out there less than a second? Because that's how quick a, a lounge fly collector posts. <laughs> they don't be playing with it. Well, lounge fly, please answer these folks' emails. Next comment, please. Instead of giving out a coupon, maybe you should give the option to cancel. Only in the words of a lot of these commenters, only if they responded to the emails, maybe it would get done. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, three snaps. Especially the ones who have ordered Christmas theme bags, adding more orders when you are already behind seems like a really, hmm, y'all see the word idea. Um, I'm telling y'all, um... I do kind of feel for a lot of collectors that may have ordered and wanted to get the bags, whether it be for a family member themselves or they're going on a special trip. A lot of folks are really particular about stuff like that. I have noticed for a while now. It's been going on for a while. When they order something, they would like to have it before they go take the trip, you know. And that, that I can understand. I truly can. Well, I'm going to give you all my final thoughts on this whole situation right here. Overall, I mentioned in my other videos when I did the Launch Fly Rant video, I do think the Cyber Monday deals has to be hands down one of Launch Fly best deals I have yet to see from them. Amazing, amazing deals. For the delays is concerned, I'm really happy that they posted something. Even this update seems to be delayed because from what a lot of folks are 
But what a lot of collectors are saying that they have all this plays way before this whole Black Friday and Cyber Monday, th Monday thing and still haven't received anything. Also, Loungefly, if you all are listening out there, a lot of collectors are having issues with reaching out to you all. I know you don't have a phone number. Maybe it's the reason why you don't add a phone number on it. Fine. But when it comes to these emails, I don't know what's going on, but a lot of folks are saying they're having a hard time getting in touch with you all, wishing that you all fixed this. So when it comes to collectors reaching out to you, whether they missing something or not that they can get out to you quick enough and i'm hoping that for those artists that are going to be fulfilled that everybody receive what they want that there is going to be another headache if somebody waited a month or two or even just from black friday or cyber monday and get their package something's missing that's not going to look good i do think it should be more that's because i mean listen I don't, I don't. and you know some folks may agree to me you just cheeky they ain't had to give it to you that is true, but since they giving it, they could have gave us like 25, 30% off. I'm just saying. What y'all think? Y'all think it should have been more? I mean, it could have been. But as far as the 15%, I don't think it should have had exclusions on it. I think everything on loungefly.com website, website should have been able, that 15% should be able to tackle. Truly sorry for anybody out there who's waiting on this stuff. I know everybody made purchases for their own particular reason, whether it be for you whether it be for you to take the items with you on vacation or a family member. Whatever the situation is, I'm hoping for those who place their order before that particular day, which I think is December the 6th, that you all receive your, your orders, okay? And if I got that date wrong, please correct me down below in the comment section. Now, for those of y'all who place your orders after that, I don't know what to say to you. I ain't got that information yet. You might want to, um, I don't know if you, <laughs> some of y'all going to be like, don't, don't, don't even say email. But, hey, you might want to email them to see what they say about it. But that'll be my final thoughts on this this whole thing. You all comment down below and tell me what you think. Also, as far as my Loungefly Cyber Monday order, I did receive an email, shipping email, a day or two ago. But for me, I'm the type of collector that I don't really worry about that type of stuff. I don't, I'm, not, I'm the collector that's not in the rush to receive anything. I mean, I can take a delay or two. It doesn't bother me, but see, that's Sweet Wheels. Other collectors aren't like that, and that's fine. Some collectors are like me, and some aren't. And for those who are not, that is fine. I have no problem with that when I see folks who place orders for stuff and want their stuff right then and there because everybody's different. And, you know, they paid their money. They want their stuff. So, hey, I ain't mad at it not one bit. All right, you all. So, I'm going to go ahead and cut off my little rant on this situation right here. If I hear anything else, I'll be more than happy to make a video to update you all on what's going on. But I want to get all my collectors and sweet wellers out their opinions down below in the comment section. I mean, what you think about this whole delivery update thing? How do you feel about it? I want to know. Put it down below in the comment section. Let's talk about it. All right. So, that'll be it. And like always, if you're watching this video and you had not subscribed to my channel, definitely go ahead and subscribe, like, share, and comment on this video also hit that notification bell make sure you click on all so you can be notified whenever i drop a video or community post and until next time sweet willows and other collectors out there take care all right that, that's me playing too much right now <laughs> everyone and until next time sweet willows and other collectors out there take care